What's good, YouTube man? It's your boy Young Dub coming at y'all with another video. Uh, I know a lot of y'all have just seen the previous video that I posted. Fuck you, Orion, right now. I don't know what was going on with my damn amp. Um, she was brand spanking new. Yeah, somebody already commented uh, how to piss $750 down the drain. You are 1000% right. Uh, I do believe something was defective with that amp. Uh, she was only installed for a few days. Uh, we had a lot of rain here on Tuesday. I installed it last Saturday, as a matter of fact. We had a lot of rain last Tuesday. I got back from work, hopped in my car, turned the key, and smelled smoke. I, I hurried up and ran to the back of the car. Um, the amp was actually inside of the car. I'd open the trunk, open the back of the car, going all through it like, okay, there's no water no rain inside the car i have right as as of right right now i have no idea what the what what the hell happened um clearly i'm upset uh that's a lot of money going down the drain man but uh, i already talked to the amp lab they said 250 bucks to fix it so i'll get that to them hopefully tonight tomorrow monday whenever uh but the purpose of this video is to piss more money down the drain hopefully for um quite a while i want i need some longevity out of my amps so, uh, if y'all been on my channel for a while, you know, uh, I am a fan of Twisted Sounds. Uh, they do work. Luckily, I was able to find a guy right here in Nebraska, uh, about an hour outside of Omaha, that had uh, this amp brand new. Um, he was willing to sell it to me for another high dollar amount, but hey, man, that's car audio, man. It is what it is. So, got me another Twisted Sounds. Y'all know I did have the version one of this. Uh, this one is a V2. It is brand new. Uh, he did open the box, of course. That's what you do when you get uh, new toys. Uh, but I don't, hopefully this will come through on the camera. This one here uh, came in at 47.37 at 14.6 and uncertified 51.09 at 14.4. So uh, hopefully she does work for me. Um, we do have a Midwest SPL show here in Omaha today. Uh, so I, I needed this amp pronto. I'm going to go ahead and get to that show. Uh, I do have the Twisted Sound sticker, the owner, owner's manual, all this stuff, man. But let's get to the real deal. Allen Keys. But let's get the amp out of here. This Joker is pretty doggone big, man. So uh, I don't know if it's going to be in the frame. Uh, here's the base knob. You already know I got my uh, Slam Panda one, so I'm not going to use this, even though this one is metal. So shout out to them for that. Uh, yeah, I know the one from Orion is... I'm, it's in the box, one of those boxes back there. Y'all can't even see them right now, but it's in the box somewhere back there. Um, not using it because I got my Slam Panda. Even with this, I'm not going to use the base knob. So let's get this amp out of here. This thing is heavy, man. All right. Floor. Whoops. I knock my camera over. Nope. Alright. So, y'all see it, man. Brand new amp, Twisted Sounds 3.5K. Uh, this set your boy back quite a bit, man, but it is what it is. Alright. So, <clears throat> may or may not, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna keep it all the way 100. I probably won't be doing a video today. Uh, due to the fact that that show starts in about an hour and a half, uh, I just got done cutting the yard, so I'm kind of worn out. But I got to, I got to do what I got to do. Um, I'm gonna run outside and get this installed sooner or later. Uh, but y'all see it, man. Y'all know what it is. Like I said, I had the version one of this. Uh, this is the V2. Um, you got your dual power and ground. Your speaker wire right there. And you got. Let me be careful. Like I said, this thing is heavy, man. You got your Tiffany style RCAs here. You got your gain, subsonic, low pass, bass boost. Of course, don't use that. Your phase shift and then the plug for you, the remote that comes with the amp. Like I said, my my um, I got the Slam Panda, so my bass knob will be going through the RCAs here, man. So um, stick with me. Uh, eventually, I'm going to go ahead. Eventually, I'm going to go ahead and get this thing hooked up and um, probably only turn and gain about a quarter. Um, Y'all know I do got the audio control matrix, uh, so I will be using that joker, man, and getting this stuff installed, man. So, uh, like I said, unfortunately, the Ryan's right there. She decided to go up and smoke. Like I said, so I, I believe something was wrong with the amp from Jumpstart. Uh, the minute I hooked it up, it was making some real screechy noise, like not like engine noise, but like a real screeching noise. So, I have no idea what was going on with that, man. So, um, 
right now i'm gonna just go ahead and roll with this twisted sounds man like i said i just if this joker gets me through to about labor day uh we'll see about um possibly doing a new system and that's another video update i gotta do i've been waiting on my man tyler to come through with something that i purchased from him i want to say back in march it's june now and it's been 17 messages so uh this fall i was planning on doing a gp undertakers but if my man don't come through with um, the product that he's supposed to give me, then I'm going to go ahead and switch it over to Street Beast and uh, run some local equipment, man. But right now, <clears throat> twist the sounds, man. I was trying to do everything on Ryan this year. Granted, I did sell the old Ryan speakers. I, I get that. But um, I was at least going to go HCCA to 3K. I mean, we all know the 3K SPLX is pretty much a 5,000 watt amp. This 3.5K is pretty much a 5,000 watt amp, so uh, hopefully this will be hella close to what that was, because I didn't play that for long, man. I was I was on the mind frame of trying to break in my subs, and it still pounded. So like I said, I only had, with even with the Orion, I only had to gain up a quarter, because like I said, I'm using my audio control, so we'll see what happens, man. But like that, right now, I got a little, nice little amp in there, nice little amp in there, and we'll, we'll be doing an update on that one real soon. Uh, and she's perfectly fine. No engine noise. None of that screeching noise. Whatever the hell was going on with that Orion amp. Uh, everything's golden, man. I, and I would suggest y'all highly uh, get on the Instagram, man. Because I did do... I installed all my crescendos. I ran the wires the way I wanted to. And unfortunately, I didn't record it. So, I did take a picture. And I put that on Instagram. So, make sure y'all check that out, man. But almost to 1,000 subscribers. Um, if the next video isn't about this or that amp... Uh, the next video will be about the 1,000 subscribers giveaway. I'll let y'all know what's in that package. It's going to be nice. Um, I think everybody will be happy with that, man. I don't think it'll be any complaints, man. Y'all know the deal. Any questions, comments, concerns, go ahead and hit me up. I'll try to get back to everybody. Probably not going to be on YouTube too much today. I got a lot going on. Uh, I am in Omaha, Nebraska. We got the College Road Series going on. Um, we got the Midwest SPL show today going on. So I'm probably going to be out the house all day today, man. Start off with water, and then I'm going to switch to something dark. So, we'll see what it is, man. It's your boy, Young Dub. Y'all, please enjoy y'all weekend, man. Stay tuned. Uh, everybody's eligible for that 1,000 subscriber giveaway, man. I'm just trying to spread some love, man. It's your boy, Young Dub. I'm out. Have a good weekend.